Well, I'm working so much. I'm sorry. There's just no way for me to really do videos. I don't have electricity in half of my apartment. So that's a little difficult to film there. I'm working 12 to 16 hours a day. Apparently, even though I have a job everyone makes fun of, I'm now essential. I just don't get insurance and cool stuff like that. Um, this is hard on everybody. I have to work. If I don't work, I don't have anywhere to live. Um, everything gets shut off, and then I'm staying in my car. I mean, that's point blank. I, uh... I know people are stressed out. They're staying at home. They're losing their minds. They're getting cabin fever. It's not better out here, y'all. It's not better. Um, I pick up food. I go into an empty restaurant. TVs are off. Bars are empty. T tables are empty. Chairs are up on the tables. It's freaking me out. Uh, even being out. It's not helping with depression. It's not anything. I said, you have people that order food. They think it's okay for you to work for free. They don't tip. But we're penalized when we don't take shitty orders. So we have to work for free so that we don't lose our job. And it's just, it's all day. You try not to cry. You're upset. Everything is bad. My mom, I'm sorry. My mom had half a lung removed last year due to an infection. So she obviously is compromised. I can't go anywhere near her. I can't visit her. I can't go see her. I can't anything because I'm out in public. So I can't take this to her. I don't get to send her food or do anything for her because she lives in a small town and they don't have delivery. There's no grocery delivery. There's no Postmates or Instacart or DoorDash. None of that is where she's at. So I'm completely stressed out about her getting out and having to go get what she needs. Um, people are treating me like crap. And then, and then you get someone nice and I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm just, whew, sorry, I'm losing it. Um, someone at Panda Express told me my eyeshadow looked nice and I damn near lost it. Um, and then my last order tipped me really well like $20. So I was like, oh, there's nice people out there. We just all really need to realize that everyone is stressed out and everyone is having bad times regardless of if you're stuck at home, if you have to work. I don't get PPE. The company I work for doesn't care. No one's giving me anything. There's nowhere for me to buy it and I'm out in public. My mom is concerned there's now seven confirmed cases in the town I live in. But what's she going to do? She doesn't have equipment either. I can't go buy it, but she's worried about me. I'm worried about her. <laughs> My sister video chatted us both yesterday because she just had to see us. My mom doesn't video chat, by the way. So the fact that she even let her do it was a trip. But... Everyone just, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I don't even know what to say. I don't know what to do. Um, I just, we need to try to be a little kinder to each other. My goodness, this is ridiculous, y'all. Um, I'm trying to keep track of my friends. Um, I don't know. Everybody just... Take a deep breath. Hopefully we get through it. Bye.